Fernando Valenzuela came from humble beginnings. He was born in a small town in Mexico. He loved baseball from a young age and dreamed of playing in the big leagues. Valenzuela signed with the Los Angeles Dodgers at 17. He was a left-handed pitcher with a unique delivery. He worked hard to improve his skills and rose through the minor leagues. In 1980, he got his first taste of the majors. He pitched in 10 games for the Dodgers, showing flashes of brilliance. He was ready for his chance to shine. The stage was set for a legendary career. The 1981 season began with uncertainty for the Dodgers. Their star pitcher was injured, and they needed someone to step up. A young Fernando Valenzuela got the call. On April 9, 1981, Valenzuela took the mound on opening day. He pitched a complete game shutout against the Houston Astros, baffling hitters with his screwball. He captured the attention of the baseball world. It was the start of something special. Valenzuela won his next four starts and was named the National League Player of the Month for April. He became a national sensation. His legend was born. Valenzuela's success ignited a cultural phenomenon. It was called Fernando Mania. Fans flocked to see him pitch, selling out stadiums across the country. People were drawn to his story, a young man living his dream with a unique pitching style. He became a symbol of hope and pride for the Latino community. Valenzuela embraced the spotlight, remaining humble and gracious, always putting the team first. He became a role model for millions. Fernando Mania transcended baseball, becoming a unifying force that celebrated diversity and inclusion. Section 4, A Beacon of Hope for Latinos Fernando Valenzuela's impact on the Latino community was profound and far-reaching. He was one of the first Mexican-born superstars in Major League Baseball, paving the way for future generations. He broke down barriers and inspired a generation of young Latinos to dream big. Latino fans saw themselves in Valenzuela, finding a sense of belonging and pride. He represented their hopes and dreams, showing them that success was within their reach. He showed them that anything was possible, no matter where they came from. He gave them a voice and a hero to cheer for. His success transcended borders and united communities. He became a cultural icon in Mexico, celebrated by millions. He was a source of national pride, embodying the spirit and resilience of his people. He proved that Mexicans could compete and excel on the world stage, breaking stereotypes and setting new standards. Valenzuela's legacy continues to inspire young athletes today, reminding them that with hard work and determination, they too can achieve greatness. Section 5. A Career Forged in Fire Fernando Valenzuela's 1981 season was one for the record books. It was a year that saw him rise from relative obscurity to become a household name in the world of baseball. He won the Rookie of the Year award, a testament to his incredible talent and hard work. He also won the Cy Young Award as the league's best pitcher making him the first player to win both awards in the same year. He helped lead the Dodgers to a World Series championship, cementing his place in baseball history. Valenzuela continued to pitch well for the Dodgers throughout the 1980s, consistently delivering strong performances on the mound. He was a six-time All-Star, showcasing his skills among the best in the league year after year. He threw a no-hitter in 1990, a remarkable achievement that highlighted his enduring talent. He was a durable and consistent performer, known for his reliability and skill. Valenzuela finished his career with 173 wins, a testament to his longevity and effectiveness as a pitcher. He had a 3.54 earned run average, reflecting his ability to keep opposing teams at bay. He struck out over 2,000 batters, demonstrating his dominance on the mound. He played for six different teams over 17 seasons, adapting to new environments and continuing to excel. His numbers reflect his talent and longevity, painting a picture of a career that was truly forged in fire. 
Section 6. Life After the Diamond After retiring from baseball, Fernando Valenzuela remained active in the game he loved. He worked as a broadcaster for the Dodgers. He provided color commentary in both English and Spanish. He also became a successful businessman. He opened a restaurant in Los Angeles. He remained involved in charitable work. He supported various causes in the United States and Mexico. Valenzuela was inducted into the Hispanic Heritage Baseball Museum Hall of Fame in 2003. He was recognized for his contributions to the sport and his positive influence on the community. He never forgot his roots. Section 7. An Enduring Legacy Fernando Valenzuela's story is one of perseverance, talent, and cultural impact. His journey from a small village in Mexico to the bright lights of Major League Baseball is nothing short of extraordinary. He rose from humble beginnings to become a baseball icon, capturing the hearts of fans everywhere with his unique pitching style and infectious enthusiasm for the game. He inspired millions of people around the world, not just with his skills on the field, but with his story of determination and success against all odds. His legacy extends far beyond the baseball diamond, influencing generations of players and fans alike. He broke down barriers for Latino players, paving the way for future stars to shine in the sport. He showed the importance of diversity and inclusion in sports, demonstrating that talent knows no boundaries. He proved that dreams can come true with hard work and dedication, becoming a role model for aspiring athletes everywhere. Valenzuela's impact on baseball and society will never be forgotten. His achievements continue to resonate with fans and players alike. He will always be remembered as one of the game's most beloved figures, a true ambassador of the sport. He is a true legend whose influence extends beyond the field and into the hearts of those who love the game. His story continues to inspire us today, reminding us that with passion and perseverance, anything is possible.